A wildlife mystery tonight. Bears so comfortable with humans, they'll climb right in their car for a ride. Wildlife researchers say that it's evidence of a disturbing trend of neurological disorders in California black bears. CBS 13's Marley Ginter joins us live after talking with researchers. Marley. Now, Tony and Elizabeth, this is pretty incredible. These stories of what these bears will do when they're around humans. Researchers describe them acting like puppy dogs, but they actually have a neurological disorder. It's a mystery disease that they're spotting more and more. You come across a bear, and that bear's first instinct should be to run away. But researchers with the California Department of Fish and Wildlife have come across some bears with some odd behavior. Someone opened the, the trunk, and it climbed in the trunk. That is definitely not normal bear behavior. And that's got to be a red flag, right? That's got to be a red flag that... that something is not right. Dr. Brandon Monk, senior wildlife veterinarian, started studying these overly friendly bears in 2014 at the investigations lab in Rancho Cordova. With the help of researchers at UC Davis, even performing CT scans, necropsy showed the bears had encephalitis, a neurological disease, but there's no telling how they're getting it. We started seeing something strange about I believe it was about five years ago. And Bryant is the executive director of the Bear League. She remembers one of the bears walking right into a school full of kids, making himself at home in the classroom. And he sat in the back just like a puppy dog. Um, that was not normal. That bear should have been terrified to go into a building with a you know, a lot of people. So it's complicating things for researchers. They appear normal, just friendly. Some even appear healthy with good looking fur. Right now, there's just so many unknowns about this, but yet it's out there, it's happening, and it definitely is getting worse. A wildlife mystery, but researchers reminding everyone friendly doesn't mean safe. Next thing you know, oh, maybe I'll just hand feed it and see if it takes it out of my hand. You know, those are situations where you're getting a lot closer to getting bit potentially. Yeah, so above and beyond, don't get too comfortable with these bears. Although they're friendly, their behavior is still unpredictable. So best bet is to call wildlife officials or the Bear League if you spot one of these bears behaving oddly. And then they're even asking if you could take a little bit of video, if you can do it safely, just so they can monitor the behavior. Hmm.